Hello, hello YouTube, Chash Text back with another video and today's video is about Windows 11 update failure specifically for the version which is KB50 10.38.6 version which may not be installed on your computer so if you face this problem you are in the right place and for this video I'm going to show you four solutions that will solve this problem so let's see what are the solutions so the first solution would be opening your uh here uh, here open your on your search click your search uh, icon and type for settings so after you type settings then select settings and on settings uh, on the system section you will find troubleshooter category which is on the system section as you can see here on the system section so Go to the bottom part and you will find here troubleshoot so select the troubleshoot so after you select the troubleshoot you will find other troubleshooters and open other troubleshooters and you will find windows update here so then select run so it will check the specific failure related with this uh, windows not installing or error message due to the installation process so here it's detecting the problem related with the Windows update. It may take some time, so keep patiently until it finished detecting the problem and fixing all those problems. So here it says troubleshoot has completed. So then select here close and turn uh, close the setting window and check your Windows update section if the solution uh, that you are seeking is solved. If the Windows update failure is still there, then the second solution will be going into the, uh, which is get into the service section of your computer and update services related to Windows update. So to go to, go to the service section, select here the search icon and type here on the search icon services. And here we find service, then select the service. And when the service section opened, you are going to update or you are going to restart some services so the first one will be uh, background intelligence so click b on your keyboard and here we find the background intelligence transfer service then right click on it and go to properties right click on the background intelligence service then go to properties so after you go to properties then Check the startup type, which is by clicking here the arrow, then select automatic. Then after you select automatic, if the start section is here is not inactive on your section, so click the start. But if it is inactive, just go to here, apply, then select OK. So as you can see here, the startup type is automatic. So next, search for Windows update. So click here. W on your keyboard. So when I click W, it will, will get me to the W sections, which is terms related with Windows Update. So here we find Windows Update Medic Service, which is that we are searching on. So after you find this one, then right click on it, then go to Properties. So after you go to Properties, then go to here to the drop down menu select it then select automatic and select here start and it's starting then select apply then select apply then select okay okay then close this one in my case it's access denied but it it will work or if it's if it is working on your side select apply and okay then close this one and uh, select here the restart I can restart on the service icon. Select restart, then it will restart all the Windows update sections and close the service section and check whether the Windows update failure is solved or not. So if the second solution is not working for you, then you will have a third solution, which is a link that will help you to fix uh, with Windows uh, 11 installation tool. So I'll put this link on the description box which uh, that you can find and you can copy the link 
So select and I'll select and I'll copy. Then on the browser, I'll paste the link that I have and press enter. So after if you press enter and the here the Microsoft website is opening, which is the Windows 11 installation assistance. So download this Windows 11 installation assistance. As you can see here, Windows 11 installation assistance. Then here the download icon. So I'll select download this installation assistance uh, on my computer. So, so here it is downloading the Windows 11 installation assistance as you can see here. So after the download completed, then uh, we are going to open this Windows 11 installation assistance to fix the failure related with, with Windows update. So it's finally there. Okay, then I'll select this one and select here up. So it will open the Windows 11 installation assistance for your computer. And also if it is not opening, you can find it on the download section, which is on the location uh, that your download is, your download will be preserved. So here I found the Windows 11 installation assistance. In some cases it may not open. So if it's not opening or showing you this kind of uh, page and if, if, it, if it opens and uh, if it closes back by itself, then right click on this Windows 11 installation assistance, then go to properties. And after the property open here, compatibility, then after you, call, you select compatibility, then select run this program in a compatibility mode. Then here the drop down menu will be opened and select it, then select Windows 7, then select here apply and select here OK. Then after click here the Windows 11 installation assistance. I'm sure it will open directly the, as you can see, install Windows 11. So here accept and install all those Windows 11 installation assistance and it will update all the failures related with your computer. So after the Windows 11 installation assistance update completed, then check the Windows update. But if this solution also not working, then check solution number four. So solution number four will be here I have uh, some code and I will put this code on the description box. So copy this code until this, just copy this and minimize it and create uh, a, a notepad or you can select here the search icon and type notepad, notepad and the notepad will be open then paste the command that we copied from the other notepad here here this one then save this file save and save it with this name this woof wufix dot path copy this and paste it then here here Paste it and save us type will be select this one and make it all files. So then put it on the desktop and select save. So as you can see here, the roof, the file that WFX came on the screen, then right click on it and select run as administrator. So as soon as you select the run as administrator, then it will start the CMD, it opens the CMD and it stops the Windows update services and the background intelligence services and start, it starts scanning all the failures related to Windows update. Then after it will restart back the Windows uh, update service and the background intelligence service that uh, we had seen earlier. So it will finish and uh, then finally you can restart your computer and check whether the Windows update uh, failure is solved. You can check whether it's solved or not. So as you can see, it's taking time to process all those the scanning process. So 
wait until it finish all this activity then after it finished the scanning then go to uh, your co your computer and restart the uh, computer then check back uh, whether the solution the problem is solved or not so uh, this is all about uh, for today's video on how we can fix windows update failure uh, which is on a specific area on Windows 11 on its specific version. So if you are new here, please subscribe, like, uh, and give me comments on the comment section for today. Just take out.